Hi everybody, it's Christine. Um, I wanted to do a Disney Store haul because um, they're having good deals right now too, especially uh, if you go and you buy uh, two or three of an item. Usually it's two and it'll be at a discount rate. And of course you probably don't have to buy two, but why not, right? It's Disney. And, but first I wanted to show you this guy. Oh, the glare is terrible. Anyway, he's a light-up jack-o'-lantern. Um, my husband ordered him with our... Uh, oh, wow, that's bad. <laughs> Very glary, sorry. With our Disney Movie Rewards points. And I was surprised at how cool he was. I didn't really pay him that much attention when he decided to place the order. So I was, I was impressed with him. So if you're not a Disney Movie Rewards member... You should check it out because you can get some pretty cool stuff. And so anyway, this is one of the things that I bought. It was on sale when I ordered it. And it's this year's Halloween mug from Disney, of course. It's pretty decent size. It's not as big as the other one I have, but um, that one's a couple years old. So I'm not sure when they got smaller or if this is just they're trying out this size. I think it holds about the same amount of liquid. I'm not sure. I usually have larger teacups and coffee cups. <laughs> See my ducky? That's for my youngest son. It's the tea thing. The little tea strainer. Um, speaking of which, I'm going to take a sip. Mm. Mm. Black cherry tea. Yum. Okay, so these are what started the whole buying thing. Chip and Dale and their little bells. Isn't that cute? I know that's probably annoying. Sorry. Um, but they're a good size. They're about three inches tall and around an inch wide each. And they come together, the two of them. Um, ooh, wow, off camera, that's not good. And they've got really good detail, high glitter. The glitter is really, really cute on them. See their little outfits and stuff? Okay, and so then I was looking for... One of my favorite characters, of course, Tinkerbell. See how pretty she is? Isn't she lovely? I'm going to put them over there so they're not ringing the whole time. Probably the same with her. She's got little bells underneath. She also um, lights up, I think. Yep, she lights up. I haven't pulled the, the little thing, so let's check it out together. Turn it on. Oh, it's her wings. Can you see that? Can you see? I don't know if you can see. Oh, there, you can see better now. See? Isn't that cute? Oh, that's going to be so pretty on the tree. And she's about, let's see, if you don't include the bells, she's right about four inches tall to the tip of her wings. And her, she's got about a two and a half inch square footprint all around the base. And if you include the bells, um, she's about five inches. Very cute. All right, focus properly, please. There we go. Focusing. All right, shutting her off. Sorry. So, the next one I decided to get was Alice. I've been infatuated with the Alice in Wonderland books since I was very little. I think I started reading them goodness. I don't know. I remember the story um, from pre-kindergarten and um, loving the story and how inquisitive she always was. I even named my dog after her. It just, <laughs> I wanted a really smart dog. <laughs> and it worked out. And then, of course, I had to get Jack because he's got scary Teddy and you don't see scary Teddy very often. So I love the wreath too. Isn't that funny? So he's he's pretty good size. Oh, I forgot to tell you the size of Alice. Hang on. He's pretty good size. He's about four and a half inches tall and about, mm, if you include the elbows, I'd say about three inches. Um, she, back to Alice, is about four inches tall. She's got about a two inch footprint and she's about mm, two and a quarter if you include the elbow in the little drink me sign. So they're pretty good size. And uh, 
definitely high quality, well worth it. And of course, Dumbo had to come to my house. I don't think I have another Dumbo ornament. Um, if Hallmark did one, I might have one of theirs. I used to get a lot of Hallmark, but I just love the quality and the weight of the Disney ones. And uh, they're just, right now, they're, they're my favorite. So he is about four inches long, three and a half. But with those ears, he's definitely four inches wide and just under four inches tall. So he's he needs like a four, four by four by four box at the very least for storage, but he's very cute. Look at the detailing on him. Little Timothy, very cute. I love him, he's very cute. So the next one was a Tinkerbell. Again, can you see? I like Tinkerbell. Yes, it's the attitude and it's got a little mirror on the bottom she stands about five inches tall, and I'd say a good three inches wide. Um, her footprint is, uh, what, two by three? And she's got a lot of good detail on her face. I'm always looking at the faces of the tanks because sometimes they look a little crazy. And I've got enough crazy, I don't need to share that. <laughs> so... She's got good glitter on her dress. Oh my goodness, good glitter on her dress and light glitter in her wings. Can you see? That doesn't help. Does that help? There, can you see a little bit? Of, it's not really acting all glittery, um, but I'm sure it'll pick up the Christmas lights beautifully. So I'm looking forward to seeing that one on the tree. And I found another really cute Chippendale in a glass, an open glass ornament, similar to those terrariums they have at Joann's right now, except those have holes in the back, which is kind of strange, but okay. Um, nice snow on top. This has a little over three inch square, so like three and a quarter square footprint. Um, more like three and a, well, three and a half, more like three and a half all the way around. A very cute, nice flat bottom, so you can just set him out if you don't want to um, put him on your tree. But why wouldn't you? It's so cute. Love him. Them, sorry, them. I'm not singling out one child more than the other. And I was amazed to see Miss Bianca. And okay. His name is escaping me. Oh dear. Um, just totally lost it. But they're on this really nice um, crystal. I think it's Lucite with a opalescent finish to it. Good detailing on their faces. Um, they're about, there's four inches um, wide and about three inches the other direction, about two and a half, uh, no, with her hat, three inches tall, and um, good weight to this one, too. Bernard, that's his name, Bernard, Bernard, see, I knew it would come to me eventually. Oh, dear, that was my phone. Sorry about the tweet. And then I ordered some of these because I hadn't um, seen these yet in person, open. I'd seen the packs, and I was super excited. The first one I opened was Pooh. Isn't that cute? I didn't expect them to look like that for some reason. I expected them to be really super squishy, and they're not. They're a nice hard plastic, good size, about three inches by two inches, and um, nice attachment. I don't know if I'd actually put that on my bag to carry it. I used to with the, the little tiny ones that they had. I had them on my backpack because all the kids' stuff was in my backpack, of course, because I'm the mom. And they're all about the same size. And then I got Jack. Okay, focus, focus. See the detailing on him? Isn't he cute? I thought that was really well done. I was impressed. And then I got Stitch. Isn't he adorable? Ugh. 
just want to hug him and squeeze him and <laughs> even on the back see they have cool detail so yeah I really like these these are really cute they're a hard plastic um, they'd be great for kids um, I don't know if I'd get them for really small kids but they're a good size and nice nice feel to them you know nice tactile uh, feel soft um, and smooth not terribly bumpy just on the details you know but I thought they were really cute. They'd be good stocking stuffers for your uh, Disney fanatic friend. Hi. Um, <laughs> um, and, of course, whenever I get a pack, I always get duplicates. And I'm not complaining about that one. Because he's just too cute. He'll go in my case with all my Nightmare Before Christmas stuff that I've got. And, well, if somebody wants to trade, let me know. Um, anyway, so... oh. That's my phone again. All right, ladies and gentlemen, bye. Thanks for watching and uh, have fun setting up your trees or your decorations or whatever holiday you decorate for. And um, see you again soon. Thanks for watching.